Hey guys, how's it going? It's Joel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to add a digital signature in Adobe Acrobat Pro DC. All right, so once you have your PDF document, you wanna open it in Adobe Acrobat Pro DC. So I'm just going to open it here. All right, so once you've got it open, you want to head over to the right hand side and click on fill and sign. Then it's gonna say who needs to fill and sign. So in this case, I need to fill and sign. I need to add my signature on this document. So I'm gonna click on me. And then it's gonna do something like this. You're gonna see this little cursor thing that says AB. And then this is where my signature needs to go. So I'm gonna click on this right here. And then I'm gonna click on this button right here with the squiggly and the pen. And then I'm going to click add signature. You can also do add initials. So I'm gonna click add signature. And then if it already pre fills it in, you can go and just erase that. But I want to do, I wanna draw it out here. So now you can either use your mouse or if you have a touch screen. So I actually have my laptop as a touch screen. So I'm just gonna do like just a fake scribble here. So I'm just gonna go, meow, okay. Signature, boom, okay. So let's pretend that that is my signature. It is not my signature and pretend it is. And we click apply. Now it's going to go wherever your mouse is and you now need to place it where you want it to go. So I want it to go over here. So I'm going to click. You can either make it bigger, smaller. I know I went the other way. Bigger, smaller, uh, maybe just like that. Then you can click out of it. And then there you go, you've got a signature. Now the cool thing is when you go back here to the sign squiggly thing, it's going to save your one signature. It's only going to save one at a time. It's not gonna save multiple if you need to have multiple people sign a document. It's just gonna do the one and then you can also do add initials. So it'll save one signature and it'll save one initial. Now, if you don't want this signature anymore, and let's say you've opened up a new document and it's someone else that needs to sign, then you can just click the minus sign here to get rid of it, and then you can add a new signature, but it'll still keep the one that you placed on your PDF document. So from here, you can just go ahead and save your document and send it to whoever needs it after you've signed it. And that is how you add a digital signature in Adobe Acrobat Pro DC. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If I was able to help you out at all, please let me know by giving this video a like, a comment, or subscribe. All that would be very much appreciated. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Back, back, back from the dead.